Even though you normally see the top of our heads because we're texting our friends, we do want to talk to adults about issues that are important to us. Sometimes we just don't know how to bring up something as serious as teen suicide. About one in four teens have more than passing thoughts of suicide each year. This is an issue we want to talk to you about. It's hard to go to the guys on like the football team or I play lacrosse too and talk to them about how you're feeling that day or how you've had these thoughts or how someone else is having these thoughts and how to go about dealing with them. Well, it's definitely against our instincts to talk about it, but it's very important to know that by talking about it, we're able to help our own generation and generations after us to know that there is hope. I had a friend last year, she was one of my best friends, and she committed suicide. And she had actually told one of her other friends that she was thinking about doing it and stuff, and she made a promise that she wasn't going to tell anybody, and she kept it a secret. And now um, the friend who she told has to go through counseling for herself because she knew what was going to happen and she didn't say anything. Right, right, a real... And I think that poses, um, I mean, again, what we're talking about here is permission, right? So giving each other permission to talk about that these thoughts are real, but also, uh, you know, knowing that you, you, you can give yourself permission for breaching that confidence and, and especially, um, you know, to save somebody's life. When you save a young life, you, you uplift, uplift an, an entire, entire community. community.